Eight-year-old Suli Peak suffers from a regressive neurological disorder that results in severe seizures. Pharmaceutical treatments led to bad reactions. Cannabis oil, according to her father, is the closest thing to a cure. It's helped her. It's improved, given her the only chance of quality of life. And on two occasions now, once in the hospital and once at home, it's actually saved her life. Suli is one of more than 200 people around the country that rely on cannabis products from Adelaide producer Jenny Hallam. She provides the oil from the illegal plant for free. There are children in Queensland and on the Sunshine Coast that if they go one dose without this medicine, they literally could pass away. It is that simple. Police raided Ms Hallam's operation yesterday, threatening jail time if she continues to produce the oil. It's been one of our greatest fears. And it's come true. Governments across Australia continue to debate legalisation for medical use. As yet, there's no approved domestic production or adequate legal framework. The Office of the Acting Health Minister in Queensland today said the government does not support patients cultivating their own cannabis for therapeutic use and does not intend to otherwise legalise or decriminalise the use of cannabis generally. Our government can take some pressure off these parents and these patients and give them amnesty. It's a simple signature. Chris Campy, 7 News.